What's up? Twice the target out here. Hmm. Here to do trailer review for War for the Planet of the Apes. So let's talk about the trailer. Now, Rise of the Planet of the Apes, I thought it was a great film. It was definitely a great introduction to this rebooted series. I thought it was just a great film, a great introduction. Definitely was so engaging. It was so well written. And Dawn of the Planet of the Apes somehow became better than Rise of the Planet of the Apes. I don't know how, but Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, wow, that was incredible. Man, did that movie just rock my birthday. Because I actually did get to see Dawn of the Planet of the Apes on my birthday. Now with War for the Planet of the Apes. Just like with Dawn, it's actually coming out on my birthday weekend. So there's already another reason for me to be excited about this. Just looking at the opening shot where you see Caesar, you could tell that humanity has hit him quite hard from his experiences from Rise and Dawn. He's the one that's saying that he didn't start this war or anything and then you get this really great action piece where you see the apes against the humans and then it gets all pitch black like the action scenes for what I saw in this trailer were so well filmed they were so intense my palms were shaking from the action scenes I was blown away I was speechless watching this trailer let's just say that this trailer is so good I was legitimately speechless i didn't i didn't know what to say after that that's how incredible this trailer was and then of course you do see woody harrelson who is confirmed to be the full antagonist of the film but i'm sure there's going to be a reason behind him you know just seeing both sides the apes point of views the humans point of views what they think differently and then there's this last line that really did get to me was when woody harrelson said that if the apes win, it will legitimately be just a planet filled with apes. Well, in this case, he said it'll be the planet of apes. So that was really great right there. And let me just say, visually, oh my goodness, the apes already look twice as more realistic than they did with Dawn. And that's saying something, because Dawn, they looked really realistic, but somehow visually it looks better. I don't know how, but it just does. And cinematography, oh my goodness. Goodness, I'm really excited for War for the Planet of the Apes, you guys. This is hands down one of my most anticipated movies of 2017. I really hope it turns out to be at least a good movie. Of course, if it's fantastic, that's amazing. But if it ends up being just a solid good film, I'll be happy with that as well. Because you guys know me, if a movie can at least be good and solid, I'll be satisfied and I'll be happy. Wow, I was blown away. Matt Reeves... I look forward to seeing what you'll do with War for the Planet of the Apes. Count me in. I'm on the hype train for this film. So that's my trailer review for War for the Planet of the Apes, you guys. Let me know in the comments down below if you're looking forward to War for the Planet of the Apes. Are you looking forward to it? Are you not looking forward to it? I would definitely be very interested to know. This is 22 Tiger Dude here. And don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power.